Welcome to another edition of IMO Sports with Pedro Justice. Guys, I just want to let you know that CBS Events felt that their replay of the fight didn't happen enough times, so they blocked me in the United States and a few other countries. But since I didn't do anything wrong, I'm still able to give you some of the highlights from the fight. Showtime, Sean Porter wins by unanimous decision over Danny Swift Garcia. I had Sean Porter winning the fight seven rounds to five. I feel that Sean Porter did some of the things that I was saying. When he won a round, he won a round. And the rounds that were close, the judges gave to Danny Garcia. I believe that it was a close fight. I just wanted the judges to be fair. When I saw the, the judges that were announced, I thought, hey, anything could happen here. They're different judges. I've seen a few of them a couple of times before. So let's see what happens. And when Sean was winning the rounds, he was winning decisively. He threw more punches. He looked like he was actually putting in work. So, and Danny looked confused at times. Danny was not able to counter punch like he wanted to. Sean Porter, however, was able to counter punch more effectively than Danny Garcia. That surprised me. Also, Sean Porter was throwing the jab, and like his dad told him, when he threw the jab, he didn't have to worry about the left hook. I am very impressed by Sean Porter. He did what he had to do. He took the energy. He didn't start the fight off well. Those first rounds, the way he started off trying to be so technical, that didn't work for him. But when he went through what he knew, it worked because he didn't smother his punches. He had just enough distance, and when he was close, he hit him in the body. And that's what you're supposed to do. He didn't let up. And I think that constant pressure was too much for Danny Garcia. And now for Angel and Danny Garcia, it's back to the drawing board. And for Sean Porter, it's time for Errol Spence Jr. Let me know what you think. Until next time, it's Pedro Justice.